We are at a crossroads. The very values we all stand for are under attack. Populism, nationalism and far-right ideologies are gaining ground across Europe. Our societies are breeding divisive levels of inequalities, fear and polarization. This is moving us away from equality, freedom and dignity for all. In this context, we must stand firm to achieve our vision. As Commissioner for Human Rights, I make it a priority to be the voice of those most vulnerable to ensure that no one is left behind. We must strive to achieve equal rights for women, people with disabilities, migrants and asylum seekers, children, older people, LGBTI people and Roma. Another priority is to look ahead into new technological and digital frontiers that are transforming the world. While I see a lot of positive potential, we also need to look at human rights implications that need to be anticipated. Equality bodies are uniquely placed to address these challenges and work towards more open, more inclusive and more respectful societies. Through complaints mandates, you can redress individual instances of injustice. You can foster social change by tackling systemic inequalities and discrimination in your countries. Your organizations also need to equip themselves to ensure that today's existing discriminations, prejudices and inequalities are not magnified through the use of algorithms. Together, we must do better to make people feel that human rights are for everyone and that institutions like yours and mine work for everyone. Fighting for inequality is good for all and you are well placed to convey that message. I wish you a fruitful meeting and I look forward to working with all of you as we marshal our values to overcome division and hatred.